This free step-by-step -step video comes to you directly from Haynes, creators of the world's best repair manuals. Fix your car or truck the right way with our accurate and reliable information at your side. You can complete more than 200 jobs on this vehicle when you purchase the complete online manual at Haynes.com. Pull the hood release lever located on the driver's side kick panel. Slide the hood safety latch and raise the hood upwards. Support the hood with the prop rod. Apply the handbrake. Chalk the rear wheels to prevent the vehicle from rolling. Remove the wheel trim cover. Loosen the front wheel lug nuts then raise the front of the car and support it on jack stands. Remove the appropriate front wheel. On ABS equipped models, detach the wheel speed sensor harness from the strut. Remove the strut to knuckle nuts and bolts. Tapping the bolts out with a hammer if necessary. Then separate the steering knuckle from the strut flange. Remove the three strut upper mounting nuts, but do not remove the center nut. When removing these nuts, be careful not to let the strut fall down. Remove the strut assembly from the vehicle. Guide the new or overhauled strut into the fender well and position it with the studs extending up through the strut tower, then screw on the nuts. Tighten the strut upper mounting nuts to the specified torque setting. Join the steering knuckle with the strut flange and align the bolt holes, then insert the flange bolts. Screw on the flange nuts, then tighten the strut to knuckle nuts to the specified torque setting. Attach the wheel speed sensor wiring harness to the noted bracket slots. Repeat this procedure on the remaining front strut assembly. Install the front wheel and lug nuts. Lower the car to the ground and tighten the wheel lug nuts to the specified torque setting. Install the wheel trim cover. Unblock the wheels.